pink Barbie hamburger. Ah. Hi Barbie dolls. I'm just a Barbie, Barbie lover in West Hollywood. Thanks so much for my video. Today I'm doing pink food cooking. I made Barbie pink cheeseburger today. <laughs> Oh my gosh, seriously, it's the cutest burger I've ever seen. Super cute, it looks so yummy. Have you watched my last pink food cooking episode yet? So I was making pink bread and I ended up with making pink buns. Then I still had three of them left. So today I made savory one, which is pink cheeseburger. So I hope you enjoy watching it. Let me start from cheese. Yeah. I have no idea how it's gonna be like. Let me see. Let me try with just a little bit first. Shredded mozzarella. Guess what I'm putting? <laughs> Beet powder. You know, I'm making hamburger, so I wanna make like sliced cheese. Let me put in microwave first. Okay, maybe I did too much. Now the cheese is melted, right? And I make it pink first. And I'm gonna put it here. Like wax paper. Ah! Come on, come on, come on, come on, come on. Oh, come on. Cheese. <laughs> come on, spread. Ooh! You know what? I think it's gonna work. I mean, I put too much beet butter. It's almost like wine color. Wow, look. So put this in fridge for a little bit. You know what? I'm gonna make a lighter pink one because it's too dark. <laughs> this time I wanna make lighter one. So just little, 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 little. How about that? Ah, I did too much. Burning, burning. Oh, but the color looks cute. Alright, homemade sliced cheese. Put the fridge. Okay, here's the bowl. And today I use turkey, ground turkey. Since I'm gonna make into pink, right? I wanna try to make it whiter first before putting beet butter. So I'm putting a little bit of tofu today. To be honest, I'm not a huge fan of American tofu. The, compared to Japanese tofu, it tastes really, really, really different. <laughs> yeah. But today I didn't have time to go to Japanese market, so I'm using American one. I don't know how much I need, but let's do like one third. Since the tofu is too soggy for burger first, so put it on the plate. Yeah, the paper towel in, in microwave. So. The tofu looks like this. Yeah, it's not like a super dried up, but you know, less soggy. Let me put maybe like that as much, maybe. And the salt and the seasonings. And I put some sesame because I just like the texture. And put some beet powder. Starting from a little. And let's see. Yeah, beet powder is not enough at all. I need some more. I don't want to put food color, but I might need it because it's getting too soggy. It's optional because it's already kind of pinkish. So yeah, food color is optional this time. Yeah, when I cook, I think it should be fine. Put some oil. Ah, 
Ah, yeah, that it's not really pink anymore, huh? But I just don't want to let it burn. Maybe it's the water from tofu or beet butter. But it's okay. Actually, soak it and then make the color pinker. So I can make the patty more pinker. Just keep doing this, you know, and make the color pink. These are cooked and actually they look so pink. Yeah, pink enough. Um, let me take this out first. It smells good. Okay. I don't have any tomato or something today, so you know what? To make it more volumey, I'm gonna make a little egg salad and put in the burger. Yeah, these are boiled egg. Salt. Seasoning. Put in mayo and bit powder. Smash it. But if I put this, I don't need to put sauce. All right, I think that's good. I already warmed up my buns. Pink buns, and here, pink pate. And the pink cheese. Uh, should I make it like a double burger? Because I want to make it higher. Yeah, why not? Yeah, put this pink egg salad. <laughs> this is intense. Oh my goodness. <laughs> wow. Wow, wow, wow. Cute. Um, I'm putting this pink bobby shoot on the top. Yay! <laughs> this is the cutest hamburger I've ever seen. Seriously, I'm. I did a great job. Oh my gosh. Ta-da! I made pink burby hamburger. Ta-da! 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 Oh my god! I cannot believe I really made it, you know? Yeah, let me eat it. I cannot wait. It looks so good. I know it might be hard to eat, actually, but anyway. So, I used pink bun that I made last time. Then the pate is turkey with tofu and beet butter. Then I made pink sliced cheese. And also, I wanted to make it a little thicker volume, you know? So I put pink egg salad. Wow, okay, let me eat it. Se no, itadakimas. Mmm, so good. Too good, too good. Mitcho Super good. It definitely became one of my best, best recipes. Yeah, one of. Wow, so good. So I didn't put sauce because I wanted to make it a more clean look, you know, more Instagrammable, yeah. So I didn't put sauce, but it still has flavor, a lot of flavor, yeah. Oh, Mmm, so good. I highly recommend this recipe. But I know it's a lot of work because you have to make pink buns first, maybe the night before, but still, it's awesome. Yeah, so good. I'm gonna finish reading this. It's so good. Happy. Thanks for so watching my video. I hope you like my video. Subscribe my channel and follow me on Instagram. Hope you have pink stuff for the day. Bye. Me too, shit.